They are not at all. Now I do want to backtrack just a moment to just before midnight. Actually, when we did see a little bit of accumulation of what looked like it was mostly rain, maybe a little bit of a wintry mix, and that possibly has left behind some slick roadways as we look up toward the northwest. So something to be aware of before you head out the door this morning. It looks like there might have just been a little bit left behind. So just take a little bit of extra caution. Otherwise, though, that system passing to the north that was trailing behind toward Iowa is continuing to move on toward Michigan, Wisconsin, Minnesota. Not really expected to impact us all too much for today. We're mostly looking at just accumulating cloud cover for today. So enjoy this nice view right now while we still have some clear skies out there. Looks like a few more of those clouds are already starting to show up over the metro. Low 30s right now feeling just a touch cooler than that. We're experiencing those cooler temperatures of the early morning hours before we really start to warm up for the day. And when we do, we're talking mid to upper 40s. Not bad at all. Continuing with that trend of above normal temperatures and running the risk that we could see a couple rain drops as we head toward the later half of today and more of those clouds continue to build in. It'll be a mix today between sun and clouds, so get out there while you can enjoy a little bit of that sunshine. We're looking at a cloudier weekend to follow. Clouds continuing to arrive as we head into the afternoon. Again, possible we could see a couple raindrops in there, but nothing significant. Not until we get into Friday morning, we start to see maybe some snow showers accumulating across some of those more northern counties into the north of I-80, leaving behind maybe just a little bit of a dusting, but nothing too significant. Cloudy skies continuing as we head closer into the weekend. So not a lot of sunshine and maybe just a little bit of snow, but again, it's unimpressive how much we're expecting to see, but still just enough that it can make those roads slick and something to keep in mind, especially Friday morning as you're heading out the door that you might be running into a few of those spots that could get a little bit icy. This weekend, though, we'll melt some of that 36 degrees for Saturday, partly cloudy skies, a blustery Sunday to follow with temperatures in the mid to upper 40s. As we head into the next week, the first full week of 2020, we'll look at temperatures still raining above normal and even some more sunshine excuse me, interlaced into their overnight lows that will be above normal as well in the 20s.